Hello everyone and welcome back again to some more Golden Sun. Uh, when last we left off we, I guess, kind of turned on the power here at the Mercury Lighthouse. Um, so now we can do stuff like this. Well then, um, I don't know if I can actually do what I want to do. No, I can't right there. Um, but yeah, so we're here trying to figure out the puzzles of the Mercury Lighthouse. So we're going to just play some hopscotch of sorts. Hop this way, hop that way. So now that I'm here... Alright, I can go up here. Come down. Get that chest. Leave no chest unchecked. Oh, um, also, while we were away, Isaac is now level 13, Garrett's level 13, Ivan's level 13, and Mia is level 12. Um, so yeah, I did do a little bit of work on them. Um, so, when we will... Uh, I can't do it, okay. We will have new Psy energy. I I do have new Psy energy of theirs to show off in some of the upcoming battles. So we will have that to look forward to. If enemies ever decide to start spawning, Not remembering these puzzles very well. I feel like I remember um, the Lost Age. Oh, thank goodness! I thought I goofed up again. I feel like I remember the puzzles from the Lost Age, um, which is the sequel to this one and the continuation. There are monsters in here! Holy crap! They're just very rare. All right, so. With Isaac, we got uh, Ragnarok. For Garrett, we got Heatwave. Um, no new Synergy for Ivan, and nothing new for Mia. But it's gonna be cool in just a sec. Ragnarok. Yes, that is such a great animation. And then Heatwave just sending out pretty much just a blaze of heat across him. But yeah, so those are our new Psy Energy that we gain. Um, very, very good single target moves, so they'll, they'll be our primary move against bosses moving forwards, if you can imagine. I think we did it, guys! And gals! And everyone else! No exclusions here. Uh, no, this isn't where I want to be yet. Or maybe it's where I have to be right now. I got Soulcrist going on in the monitor next to me, and it's... It's playing some Dragon Age, and... I don't know. It's interesting stuff. But we're not on about that right now. Soulcrist is an awesome streamer, if you haven't seen him. You should go give him a look. He's He's got some cool stuff. He's got some cool stuff. And there we go. We just filled up the room before us. So how's everybody doing? I hope everybody's doing all right. It's about the middle of a week right now. Uh, yeah, actually, this is gonna air on a Wednesday, so yeah, it's exactly the middle of a week. I'm sore from all the yard work we were doing over the holiday weekend, um, but still doing all right. Still doing all right. My wife started her new job, and well. Things are on the up and up. Now, if only I could get some sleep. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's not likely though. Now that we're starting to encounter more enemies, we might actually get a couple more levels, or at least one or two, with everybody on the team right now. 
I wonder if we'll be able to get through the entire lighthouse. I really would like to. Um, that would produce some really neat stuff. I know that sounds super generic and vague. It produced really neat stuff. Nope, I'm a potato. That doesn't need to be there yet. Because first, we do this. <coughs> we do this. We'll just kind of shoot them over. We do this. Hey, almost got it. And then I am probably gonna get. I keep. I'm, I'm trying to remember where there is the Jin. There's a Mercury Jin in Mercury Lighthouse, if you can imagine that. And I'm sitting here trying. <clears throat> try, sorry about that. Trying to remember where it is and not get it confused with the other Golden Sun game. My luck is there's not going to be anything here. Haha! I 100% expected it to be a mimic. 100%. Which means there's not anything there. Okay, I expected that to be. Oh, it's over here is where the other door is. Yeah. Not whirlwind. I need L, not R. This is gonna be cool. The water is so strong it can push back a wall. Ah, this is the room. I just gotta find the right one. Here it is. There's our little friend. Alright, we are fully stocked. Because it's gonna be a fight! Which is a good reason for us to have these fun abilities. Oh, Ivan also got sleep, but I'm not super big on using um, status ailments. Um, I would use um, buff uh -huh, moves like impact or guard over um, status ailments any day of the week. I just, I'm not just, in this game, in some games, yeah, I like status ailments a lot. Like, I love stacking debuffs on people, but just definitely not in this one. Um, actually, you're just gonna attack me. You'll probably deal more damage since it's a Mercury Shin. Wow, that was fast! Holy smokes! Wow! I'm so glad we did that leveling, because usually that takes a lot more. But now, what we can do is set this on Mia. I was hoping she gets get some Psy Energy, but she gets a huge boost to stats because she's now a Scribe. Every time you change classes, um, from adding more Jin, not necessarily switching them around, you get humongous stat boosts. Once we have, I think it's four of each Jin, we'll be able to do some interesting class combinations. Ooh, Sirens! First time we've run into these enemies. Very nice. I like it when we get to run into new enemies. Uh, plasma and Tundra. The new enemies hopefully means higher XP, higher um, coin returns. So, ooh, yeah, they're tough. Please don't put me to sleep. Yes! They're very tough!
definitely some good stuff. Um, we just got Crystal Powder, which it's an item to where it, it's essentially like you use it in battle and it does ice damage. Um, not going to be using that a whole lot. I need to just go ahead and heal everybody while I'm thinking about it. Mia is good. Not going to be using it a whole lot, but we might just to show it off. I'll, I'll probably show it off in the next fight. There's a few different items that are like that to where you can use them in a fight. And we'll let... I forget, everybody has their own inventory, so if Garrett has it, nobody else can use it. That's another... Um, definite huge mechanic difference between this and Final Fantasy is it's not a shared inventory. <laughs> if you want that character to be able to use it, you better equip him with it. But yeah, that was um, the Crystal Dust. Just ice falls from the sky. Um, if we get some more of the items, I'll show them off. The using combat items. Where is it? Seriously. And you might be wondering, how did Satros and Mernady make it all the way up here? All these statues and everything. Oh hey! Cuttlefish! Neat. Yeah, this is another one that gets a lot of palette swaps, is the Cuttlefish, Sirens. Essentially every enemy in the game gets a lot of palette swaps. Even some boss enemies end up having palette swaps later on. But at that point, we're powerful enough to where it's not a big deal. Alrighty, we are already here. Dang it. Okay. So, yeah. Um... You might be wondering what I'm doing. Why I am just sitting here running around as though I were restoring my PP before a boss fight. Yes, there is nothing like that about to happen. Of course not. Yeah, there is. There's a boss fight about to happen, that's why I'm kind of derping around here. What's this? The water appears to be flowing in reverse. I wonder what that could do for us. I think this is about to be a boss fight. No, don't go up yet! I thought we'd still be out of time. This can't be the full lighthouse. Hold on. I could have sworn the lighthouse was much longer than this. Perhaps I'm misremembering. Perhaps they just made them longer in the second game, as that's the one I would have played more recently. The lighthouse has been lit. And here we are, at the top of the lighthouse, where we just saw it be lit. Um, yeah, I'm gonna save just because... You never know. I could just royally screw it up. But here we are, at the top of the lighthouse that we just saw be lit. And that's what the lighthouse looks like when they're lit. It's too late! The lighthouse has already been lit! It can't be. The beacon cannot be lit without the Mercury Star. About that. The elemental stars were stolen from Soul Sanctum on Mount Aleph. Mount Aleph. Soul Sanctum. Are you healers from Soul Sanctum? Yes. Well, sort of healers. Isaac can, can heal. Garrett, not so much. We came from a village called Vale to recover the three elemental stars. But, unlike you, we are not healers. <laughs> Did you say Veil? 
Yeah. Our village was there to protect Soul Sanctum, but the stars were stolen. <clears throat> that sounds just like my clan. I have failed in the one duty placed upon me. This is terrible. Isaac Garrett! So it's you, Isaac. <laughs> Those kids are still alive. You came all this way to save Jenna and Craden. That's not all. We're after the elemental stars. In other words, they've come to stop us. Then we have no choice. Let's take care of them now before they can do any harm. Mernady, wait. <clears throat> oh, Satros, they want to... I heard everything. They were lucky to survive the eruption on Mount Aleph. You've endured so much, and now you want to throw your lives away. Fine. If that is your wish, prepare to have it granted. Satros, are you going to fight them alone? Mernady, I can't expect you to leave our hostages alone and help me, can I? Um, that's true. Besides, I want to see how much their powers have developed. Are you sure about this, Satros? Satros. Leave me be. Head for the next lighthouse now. Come here, child. Do you mean to defy me? I should teach you a lesson, child, but... Felix, I'd get your sister to obey me if you hope to keep her from harm. Jenna, please, just do as she says now. Felix. It's alright, Jenna. Isaac and Garrett shouldn't have come after us. I'm sorry, Isaac. Garrett. I'm counting on you. Isaac, Garrett, don't die! Jenna, Craden! If you want to save them, you'll have to beat me first. No, get back! What's the matter? Satros is extremely powerful. I could sense it when I faced him. You have to be very careful when fighting him. We have to match his strength. Match me? Puh! <laughs> you think you can match the great Satros? You overestimate your chances. Fine then, I'll teach you all a lesson. What happened? Satros is moving strangely. What's this? The light of Mercury, it's weakening my Psi energy! I must finish this quickly. Come on, fools. Here we go. We have seen this man before. At the beginning of the game, we had a sort of encounter with him. Um, but yeah, so we're going to actually get to face him for real this time. Let's get it off with a bang. Um, Garrett's actually going to attack because Satros is hugely resistant to fire, if you can imagine. Well, for special reasons that I think will become apparent later on. I don't remember exactly. So we're just gonna buff Garrett up, like I said. Just use him for straight attacking. Yeah. We are a lot stronger than what I usually fight Satris, thanks to the grinding I did. Um... 
This is gonna be a good fight. I, it shouldn't be too quick. Um, we're gonna make some good story progress. I wasn't sure if we'd be able to um, be able to beat the boss here and then continue on the story, but yeah, we definitely will. I wonder if Tundra would do more damage. All right, we're gonna go for Plasma now, and let's try Tundra, see if it does more than 55. I always feel like single target attacks are gonna do more, but sometimes, I don't know. Ooh, Fireball. If you'll recall, we had Fire. Fireball is the next stage up. It's, um, it's a little strong. 54. So about the same damage. Um... Garrett, I'm actually gonna have you drop an herb on Ivan. Ivan, use plasma. Mia, heal Isaac. Because <clears throat> he shouldn't do another round of fireball. But we want to be sure just in case. Yeah. Another good reason to do the grinding I did was it helped boost my PP, so we'll be better off with prolonged battles and everything. Yeah. Thankfully there's not too many fights early on. Most of the fights where you have to do like real tactical battling and it gets really stressful are later on. I just realized I've been a silly sausage. I have never showed you guys um, what summons look like, really. What all the different summons look like. So yeah, let's do that real quick. Uh, we're going to boost party resistance, and we're going to do damage. So first off, boost everybody's resist. Oh, that was bad. That was bad, because I think Ivan's the one holding our heal right now. And actually, we need to summon more often. Fudge, I don't know. Alright, granite. Um, oh, you have the water of life, thank goodness. Heal yourself, Mina. Granite will pretty much make you invulnerable. Yeah, like I said, granite's gonna prevent. So he's back, water of life. I hate that we had to use that. But I want to show off these. Ramses. I did not use your other one. I haven't used your other one, but I have used yours. Nairnade. That is not how you pronounce it. I will try and do better when it pops back up. Okay, so this is Ramses. An Earth Summon. That requires two Jin. Oh, never mind. My bad. We're not going to get to see the rest of them. My bad. We will start... What I'll do is I'll start battles with them already... Um, used, so we can just straight summon at the start of the fight. Isaac, we got him. <clears throat> would have thought that Mercury Lighthouse held such great power. If only my synergy had been in its full power. Satros, you said you were weakened. What did you mean? I meant nothing. I shall tell you what he means. That voice, could it be? Alex! It's been a while, Mia. Alex, do you realize what you've done? <laughs> of course. I have freed a great power that has long been sealed away. Mercury, the lighthouse of water. What a mighty force. Alex, are you... are you mad? No, Mia. Don't you understand? 
The lighthouse granted you a great power during your battle with Satros. It's true. I could use my power without it ever depleting it. Don't you see? The Mercury Lighthouse supplied you with limitless Psi energy. Psi energy? Are you telling me my powers come from Psi energy? You and I are both members of Mercury Clan, masters of water Psi energy. Mia is an adept too, isn't she? Yep. Jeez, Isaac. You knew all along you could you didn't tell us? Tell me, Alex, why wasn't Satros able to use his full power? Ah, yes, I shall explain it all. Satros is aligned with Mars, the Clan of Fire. And there you have it. Fire and water are opposing elements. His full power was bound by the water psi energy of the lighthouse. Didn't Satros know that? Of course he knew. However, he failed to appreciate the power of this lighthouse. As did I. Is that why we were able to defeat Satros? No. There is more to it. I stood by, watching your battle from afar. You were watching us? Yes. I did not help Satros because I was certain he would win. But I was wrong. You have become such great fighters in a short time. We fought all sorts of bosses, bro. You're just one of many. Satros is, is up again, but we beat him. Me? Beaten? Never. I lost to this lighthouse, not to you. I was merely stalling you until Satros regained his strength. You were just buying time. That's not fair, Alex. I won't let Satros escape. And just what are you going to do? Will you finish him off? Yes, Isaac. You seem like a smart warrior. You can't beat our combined might, now that we've seen how you fight. And I doubt you are the type to finish anyone off. Of course you are welcome to believe whatever you want. Poof! I want that teleport power. He warped again. Yes, he did, Garrett. Thank you. Again? He's done that before? Yeah, and Soul Sanctum. That Psy energy, the warp, does that mean Mia can use it? No. It's impossible. Even Alex doesn't have that kind of power. Ah, well, I can't stay the same Alex you knew forever. Well, it seems that my ride has returned while we were speaking. And so, I bid you adieu. Isaac, Satcher still has the elemental stars. That's right. We can't let them leave now. Oh. And you want to take the elemental stars from Satros? Yes, that's why we're here. Ha! Too bad. Mernady... Bleh. Ha! Too bad. Mernady has them. You'll have to ask her. And that reminds me. Do you still have the Mars star? Of course. I appreciate your honesty. Friggin' teleport. I suppose you'll be willing to pursue us for the Elemental Stars? I look forward to it. I shall see you soon, then. Goodbye. I look forward to our next battle. Hmm. <laughs> They're gone. Shoot, we couldn't even save Jenna. I don't deserve to be a healer. We couldn't stop them from lighting the beacon. I failed my clan. Failed in my duty. That's not true. We can still beat them, right, Isaac? That's right, Isaac. 
All we have to do is stop them from lighting all the lighthouses. <clears throat> the Beacon of Mercury lighthouse may has been lit, but we'll stop them next time. That's right. We can save Jin at the next lighthouse. Yes. We won't let Alex get away with this. Let's go after them now. What's the matter? We should hurry. We? Oui. Mia, are you coming along with us? But your people of the mill need you, Mia. It's okay. The fountain shall be filled as long as the light fills the lighthouse. That's an old saying. The fountain will never run over. The fountain will run over with healing waters now. I have mixed feelings about leaving, but Emil will be fine as long as the fountain continues to flow with the water of Hermes. Everybody nod to each other. <laughs> we should follow. We should hurry if we're going to follow them. And there we have our thumbnail. <laughs> yeah, Mia, you see she is fully restored just from being near that lighthouse. <laughs> and and that um that sound you're hearing you won't hear it again. That was the gin coming out of um That was the Jin coming out of standby because after you summon with them, they enter into a standby phase to where they can't be used to summon again, but they're not beneficial to your character yet. And there are people here. Um, we're not going to talk to them real quick. First off, if you'll recall, we got a empty bottle. So now we have Hermes Water, which is a nifty item that heals all HP. Um, and we can come back here every time and refill it. But that bottle is even more important than that. But, I think that's going to be it for this episode. I have... We finished Mercury Lighthouse. Um, we Mia has permanently joined the party now. And... We found out that... The, um, Satros and Mernady were from the, Mer the Mars clan. Which is why I was thinking Mia would do more damage than she was. <laughs> because she's an opposing member and should have been able to do a lot more powerful moves. Um... But yes, thank you all for joining me um, on this episode of Golden Sun. Um, depending on how things go, I may do a couple of just teleport missions where one minute uh, you're with me and the next we're where we need to be so you don't have to travel the huge backtracking that we're going to be coming up. But um, we'll see in the next episode. So thank you all for joining me. I hope everybody had a good time. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe and take care for now.